Hmm. Tofa is in a hot, hot mess. Okay. <laughs> At this point, Biggie is playing his game by himself. I did a short live stream and I spoke about how Biggie is the one doing his thing, moving his, uh, operating his operation in his house by bringing back Dami, um, Ruti, and Chingwe. But do you know the irony of the whole thing? I don't know. I, I, I'm tempted to use the word hypocritical. This audience are acting in a very, very hypocritical manner. The thing that people are happy that those three are back. Why are you people happy that those three are back? You people said you wanted calmness. You were interested in calmness. You want calmness to win the money. So why are you guys happy that Biggie brought back those three ladies that are known for, <laughs> you know, basbos? Well, whatever it is, they were welcome back into the house. At least I believe they are coming to shake the house for like a week, right? And which is interesting, at least we would not have a bitter taste of, of watching Big Brother this season. At least last, last, let them just use those ones and redeem, you know. And the girls coming in, obviously, they want to also, it's an opportunity because someone like Dami, Dami was even forgotten. You know, when she, it took me, I'm like, okay, Dami, like, it took me a while to just even remember her. Like, it's not like I forgot her, I forgot her, but like, you know, someone that was gone the first week, honestly speaking, I, mm. so it's an opportunity. Ruti, uh, after that beef with her and the twins, he sort of popped her in the mouth of people, right? So coming in, it's to her benefit. And there's something again I love about the fact that Ruti came back to the house. At least it's an opportunity for the narrative to to, to be cleared because a lot of misunderstanding surrounding the fight with between Ruti and Wani ex Handi that time before the separation was very conflicting. And I hope they have an opportunity to have a conversation. But the one person that I never thought was going to feel insecure in that house was Anita. What's up? What's the problem? Even if Tofa is your husband, he doesn't have right to talk to anybody. After the pool party, I love the conversation that um, Dami was having with Tofa. She said, before Anita, I was there. You understand? Whatever happened, happened. And then I'm back now and you're almost not allowed to talk to me, not have any contact with me. If you have to be protected away from me, then what's up? <laughs> you know, she was like, I'm not even doing anything with you. So why all this, you know? And the guy was just, you know, he was just, <laughs> the guy was just confused. And the, 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 the lovey-dovey part of Anita suddenly just popped up. Even the Tofa is surprised. Like, hmm, see, low-key, eh, Tofa is enjoying what's happening. <laughs> low-key, Tofa is enjoying what is happening. See, the intervention or the entry of these three ladies have really spiked a lot of things in the housemates. And I'm glad because they were just all dancing to the finale, you know. <laughs> 100 million nacha is for this kind of Nigerian economy. Well, that's by the way. Um, I noticed two for the past two or three days, Onyeka and Uzi have not really been in the best of place. And the fact that this cameraman keeps jumping up and down. Not until after the pool party that um, there was a conversation between Dami, him and Victoria. Of course, Dami was literally prying into their personal affairs because you could see for the past two days now, Uzi and Victoria are almost becoming inseparable while Onyeka is just there by the side on her own. So, he now got talking that the relationship with Onyeka, more like, it's not that he didn't use the word toxic, but I'm the one using the word toxic. It's more like having a toxic vibe whereby he said they cannot stay two, three days without fighting him and Onyeka. So, of course, I think Ozzy and Onyeka lack compatibility, and that is why it looks like he finds solace with Victoria. And Victoria was just there smiling, a bit blushing. I don't know which one to see. And he is now claiming another new story coming from Ozio that he has known Victoria since 2019, even though they've not ever really, really had got to talk or they even have friends in common and all of that. I'm like, ah, this one is another story. <laughs> it's another story that we are hearing today, right? Though during the pool party for, for a while. 
the um i don't know what chingwe was discussing with the umbadunwe twins but it was a long conversation yeah chingwe was talking talking with them meanwhile during the party kelly ray and cassia had a fallout i remember last week we um victoria was complaining that on going to the garden during the pool party that people were greedy and they took away almost all of the snacks and she didn't eat anything so she and cassie i remember them saying that next week they'll make sure they pick up some and hide and all of that and true to that was what happened cassie came picked up some meat pie i went to hide in the head of house room kelly ray asked her to bring it out she refused went to bring it out for anything like immediately her mood changed ah that cassia and eh? wow that girl eh? Eesh she she her mood just changed she now went to see that me I, I was even scared i was thinking something that happened because that me went and was trying to like console her me i was even scared i said ah, what happened because i noticed there was some back and forth and kelly went to tell her something and as soon as he told her she just withdrew from the uh, because she really danced she the party was really lively everybody was dancing now nelly what happened nelly what happened all these prepared bodies so why didn't you bring it out since I like God, people's ways we caught oh, because of these three ladies that entered this house. But that's by the way. So Kelly Ray and Cassiana had issues because of the meat pie thing, because of Victoria, you know, and trust in Badin with twins. You know, they are our big brother in the house. So they were just trying to go back and forth and fix things that wants to scatter just like that. So um a whole lot later on Kelly Ray came, was trying to pacify Cassia. Cassia refused to even follow him to the head of house lounge. She went to bed in her normal bed. The guy was literally begging her. Even at some point, Victoria checked up on her her before she went to meet Ozzy and we were having a conversation. In fact, I had to go to bed. It was almost 2 a.m. Ozzy and Victoria, I don't know the conversation that they are having. They are busy. I don't know. I don't know. At this point, I don't know if it's safe to say Ozzy and Victoria are about to start a cheap ship or they have started a ship. I don't even know. And to me, I'm even happier or is better off for Nika to stay away. See, eh? when Nika is behaving at some at some point or uh, I don't know if I should use the word at some point, like he pick me, like you're begging a man to pick. When you can leave this guy outside the house self, when you can not even have time for Ozzy. Even the Victoria that they are busy doing coming body now, which maybe is all his strategy and all that according to TJ. TJ said it's all his strategy. All these things, it is what it is. Just uh when you can should stay away for her own dignity sake. That is the way me I see it. Stay away from that boy, um, Winika. <laughs> I'm even saying that see Winika is hearing me. Allow him be with Victoria because the way he's making it sound is like Victoria is peace of mind to him. Victoria is calmness. Victoria gives him peace. Victoria gives him the love maybe he desires or he requires from a woman. Or, I don't know. You could tell he right now Victoria has become his new bestie and they are really getting to bond and it's fine. Do you understand? Even in real life, like I always tell people this is a social experiment. Even in real life, if it's not working, let it be. Compatibility, you don't impose it on people. Okay? I'm glad that Onyeka is I could I like her vibe now, sir. She's free, playing with their tofa, their suj. Of course, right now she has become the new supplementary handy. <laughs> for Wani. So I'm glad she's living her life. She should not squeeze herself and attach herself to one person in the house. I wish all of them best of luck. Voting lines have officially closed. Of course, this is I'm speaking to you now. This is like Friday morning. It's already AM here. So I hope you guys were able to vote and then hopefully we are waiting for Sunday. Our fingers crossed. And the ladies in the house, the guests, biggest guests, nah, they are really dissecting some things on our behalf come are you sure there's even going to be any need of reunion at the end of this show because the reunion is already happening everything is already happening parrot has become useless in that house i beg if you watch this point thank you so much subscribe and give the video a thumbs up